It's Andre from the High Performance Academy and we're here in Sydney at Turbo Smart headquarters. Now, unfortunately these days we live in a time where counterfeit products are rife in our market so it's refreshing to come to Turbo Smart and see how these products are made all the way through from the raw products or raw materials, the design and then through manufacturing and the finished product. And we're here with Stu, the General Manager of Turbo Smart and Stu just want to talk about that process you go through. So first of all well, everything you do here is really made, designed, developed and built right here on site in Australia. Yes. Let's start with the raw products that you're sourcing. Now, how important are those products to the quality of that finished uh, product, wastegate, fuel pressure regulator or whatever we're talking about? It's a massive part of what we do. Um, if the, if the, the raw material or the seed of the product isn't right then the rest of it's not going to work properly so we have to work with the right suppliers in getting the right raw materials in the door and, and make sure that um, when we're machining that those parts or, or working with those materials that, that we can guarantee that it's the right stuff that, we, that, we're, that we're using. Now in terms of the design of the, the products, I know that's uh, a part where you've got the ability to use a lot of technology with the design and modelling of the products. Can you talk us through how that works and I guess how that's improved and sped up the, the process of manufacturing new parts? Yes, yeah, so as uh, years ago, you know, we might be hand making a, a product and we might make a few different versions of it and we're testing those um, whether or not it be uh, flow bench or, or on a vehicle, um, you know, years ago without a car, without even da data logging on it. Now we can actually, um, we can solid model um, a part, we can, we can FEA it, um, we can, we can fl flow test it on the, um, the computer model before we even have to make a physical sample of it. So we can do 10 iterations of, of one product and, and test them in the uh, computer software in one day. So what we're talking about there is modelling the, the flow, let's say for example through a blow off valve or a wastegate. So in the modelling software you can actually run a simulation and before that part ever goes near a CNC machine you've already got a really good idea exactly how much that that part's going to flow? Yes, exactly. So we can, we can do flow testing, um, we can do stress analysis, um, and we can also put heat through the product and, and see um, how much heat the product can take if, for example, it was a wastegate uh, before we even have to um, start machining anything. So it really puts us a long way in front um, very quickly of where we would be if we were just, you know, machining something and then testing it, machining something and testing it. We still have to do that at the end, but the, the beginning of the process gets sped up infinitely. Instead of now testing maybe 10 iterations with a, a mechanical part, a physical part I should say, you've now actually narrowed that all down to one that you're pretty confident is going to work in a software simulation and then you're simply testing that one final product. Yeah, that's right. So normally w w you would think that um, we'd probably get about two or three iterations of a physical product that we might make minor modifications to from the computer model that we started with. Whereas um, traditionally, I mean, you could make anywhere from five to 10 versions of that before you're gonna to get to your end product. Now the actual manufacturing process as well, you've got a huge number of CNC machines in here. Uh, how, how critical has that been to the, uh, the advancement of the TurboSmart products using CNC equipment? Well it, it, it obviously makes sure that we keep our IP of our products in-house. It also reduces the lead time if we want to make um, a modification to a product. Um, we can do that quite quickly. Also, we can keep track of all of our tolerances and little bits and pieces that we know are very important to our product that if we asked another person to supply that for us, they mightn't realise exactly why that's so critical to the way the product works. So we know why we're making it and we know exactly what we need to look for. Now, in terms of those tolerances that you've just touched on, obviously even with a, a very high-end CNC machine, uh, we, we will still see some variation in the tolerances and uh, you're purposely using those tolerances, measuring the inside diameter of your blow valve bodies plus the valve and then selecting out of the parts available to make sure that the final part is absolutely perfect? Correct. So 
there is always a little bit of hand assembly and, and some hand matching. I mean, basically at the end of the day, the TurboSmart products are handmade um, and we, we individually assemble and test each product to make sure that it's, it's doing exactly what it's supposed to do. Okay, if anyone's interested in finding out more about your range of products or purchasing, how can they go about getting hold of TurboSmart products? Basically, you can get onto our website, turbosmart.com, and we've got our whole range of products there and all our distributors around the world where you can purchase those products from. Great. Thanks for the chat, Stu. Thanks, mate. Cheers.